A recently identified pest, the yam rust fungus, is posing a significant threat to yam crops and the livelihoods of farmers in St. Lucia. The Ministry of Agriculture is taking swift action to contain the spread and educate farmers on control measures. The pest was first detected in late 2023 and an island-wide survey is underway to assess its full extent. The Ministry is prioritizing awareness campaigns to disseminate information on best practices to mitigate the spread. Okay, tell us, what measures are the Ministry taking to curb that situation? Well, in addition to carrying out a survey, an island-wide survey, the Ministry is also carrying out an awareness program with our key stakeholders, which are our farmers. And we in the present, the present, presently we have in a number of meetings island-wide. We have had one meeting, we started off this morning in in the cul-de-sac area, we had one meeting with farmers there. This afternoon, we are meeting with farmers in the uh, Region 4 area, and we're going to be continue having meetings island-wide to continue sensitization. We're also having uh, radio press releases, we're doing radio and TV interviews, and to update the farming community and let them know the corrective measures that need to be taken. Key concerns surrounding the yam rust fungus include its rapid multiplication and potential movement through infected planting material. The ministry urges farmers to implement strict protocols regarding the movement of yams and to adopt recommended practices for pest control. Movement of planting material, this is one of the key ways that the yam rust can move from one place to the other through planting material. It's also a, a fungus and it can be transmitted through wind um, in the rainy season it can multiply rapidly so we are trying to continue educating farmers and, and the public as a whole as to measures that can be implemented to reduce the spread of this fungus tell us of what significance is yam to saint lucia yam plays a key role in, for two two main reasons we can look at one is that it's a staple part of our diet our, our local diet um, people like to have yam when they have their meals, it's, it's, it's a starch that we, we have very often when we have our meals. Secondly, we can also see that it plays a really economic important role in that it's a means of revenue generation for farmers. And this is what one of the, the foods, one of the crops that support the livelihood. And we need to ensure that we continue with diversity of our, our crops. So this is one of the, one of the other main reasons that the ministry found it absolutely necessary to continue working and collaborating with farmers to ensure that we reduce the presence of this, this pest in St. Lucia. The ministry's response includes technical guidance, including providing expertise on best practices for pest management. The development also provides resources and support to farmers through its extension services. Crop extension, which I am formerly a member of, and we collab on the number of um, projects with regards to um, pest and disease management, which is very crucial. Um, pest and diseases play a very important role in that it helps, it, it affects farmers' production. So in the management of it there, we would bring on um, officers from the research and development unit to give guidance, um, um, use the, give the expertise in how, what are the best ways in mitigating or controlling these, these um, um, pests. The Agriculture Ministry advises farmers to report any suspected infestations and to follow recommended practices to protect their crops and livelihoods. The yam rust fungus affects various yam varieties including white, yellow and Portuguese. Symptoms include discoloration, wilting and stunted growth. Early detection and proper management are crucial to prevent widespread damage. Joachim Duplessis, HTS News Force.